Hello everyone. Have a nice day. In this video, I will show on how to program torque control in KVXH04ML. We will use function block library, as I show you in my previous video. If you want to know on how to download and install function blocks library, please watch my video on how to download and install function blocks library. You can follow the link on the description below. In your KV Studio, open new project. Then select KV7500, and enter the project name you want. And click OK. And click Yes, we will add KVXH4ML unit now. and click auto assign relay icon then click apply and click ok then go to your library workspace then drag your xho4ml operation enable and select kvxho4ml and fill all inputs and outputs of function block then drag your servo on function block and fill all inputs and outputs And now, drag our KVXH04ML torque move function block. This function block will control your servo in torque operation. Our function block library also includes linear operation, arc operation, and helical operation. Then drag your XHO4ML deceleration stop function block. This function block will stop your servo current command in deceleration mode. Then we will verify our program for possible error. As you can see, our program conversion is successful. You can check your conversion result here. Then go to your project workspace. Then double click your SV2 setting. And click yes. 
In your auto configuration setting window, drag and drop SV2. And click OK. And click Yes. If you are using ball screw, then input ball screw pitch. Then select your unit mm or inch. Then choose how many decimal you want. And execute calculation. And click OK. And click Yes. We already add our servo motor successfully. And it already map our SV2 configuration setting. And now our program is ready for transfer to PLC.